morning, everyone! Hi there. Hi there. Eight forty-three. Friday the fourth of February. Nicholas' birthday is now over. Oh, that is on my lip. Do I speak to the peeps? Yes, I to the peeps. Just, just, just listen to this, everyone. No, Josh, don't be farting. Come on. Go wash your phone. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of? Sweat patches. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Welcome to a new vlog. Good morning! So, today is a new day, a new dawn. It's a new life for me, and yeah. I'm feeling good. Mm. So, today is a new day of Manchester. Welcome, 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 everyone. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Nice, nice for you to be here. Um, it's currently 8.44 in the morning. We're planning on leaving the hotel at 10. Um, need to get up and get ready. I wasn't wearing makeup yesterday obviously because we were on a flight and stuff. But today I'm going to wear makeup like shopping because obviously you don't have to wear a mask. So I don't mind wearing makeup because I hate wearing masks over the top of my makeup. I just see no point in wearing makeup. So I'm going to wear makeup today. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. So yeah. That's really all for now. We're going to go get up and get ready. Are you okay? Actually, up here, dead. That's quite scary. So we're gonna go up and get ready, and I'll see you soon. Okay. Hi there. <laughs> okay, guys, we are now ready. Um, Josh let me do his hair today. So this is the fit. So I'm wearing my H and M cream hoodie that I had to buy the other day because I, I literally searched the whole of Balmina for one. Then I'm wearing my like cream jacket, my wee River Island bag. My mom jeans are from Primark. And my high top converses, and that's the fit. And this is Josh's. And you have Under Armour, Top Man jeans, Nike, Air Forces, and a new office school. Uh, this fit may change throughout the day because I might buy new stuff. <laughs> Currently having a wee Greg's. I love how you put it on top. Like, why don't you dip it in? It's nicer. I don't think it really tastes any different, but yes, yeah, Greg's for breakfast. This is in the middle of Primark. Right? That is actually so cool. Unreal. Also, we've got a basket. I think what I'm going to do is do this floor, try on the stuff on this floor, and then go up the floor because then I can get rid of obviously whatever I'm not taking. So, yeah. Okay, so currently in the pre mart changing rooms, brought in seven things. I had eight, but then I put a dress down because I really didn't need it. Okay, so nice this coat. Now it looks like black on this, but it's like a nice like, brownie colour. It's like a chocolatey, like plummy brown. Is that what you'd say it was? But like, it is, uh, it's really nice. But I'm just not 100% sure on it. But I do actually really like it, especially with this like, like this hoodie and this outfit as well. But I don't know. Okay, so next is this like pinafore, and this is a big fat no. It just makes me look shapeless, like literally. Like if it was like a bit tighter, it would be okay. No, like even like tighter, it's not even tight enough. But uh, yeah. So we've had maybe this so far, and that's it. <laughs> okay, so out the seven, I've kept these two. It's this like black like sheer skirt, and then that like coat thing. I like these jeans as well, I tried them on, they're like the tiniest wee bit too small so I'm going to go out and see if there's an eight and then this is the stuff that didn't suit. So yeah. So it is now Josh's turn to shop. Isn't he a wee creator? Well, so anytime that I shop, I'll take the basket. No, anytime I'm shopping, Josh takes the basket and anytime Josh is shopping, I'll take the basket. How cute are we? We just work that way. But um, yes, he's got boxers and a pair of pyjamas. He needed pyjamas, I don't know why I got the boxers, but anyway. And yeah, I just got some lingerie, wee sets, and a wee skirt. That's all I got. And then I got Rachel a wee pen that has a uh, stitch on it, and then I got my mum one that has grit on it because they both love grit and one loves stitch. This isn't going to focus the whole time I filmed this, has it? Of course not. But yeah, here we go. So we're now in TK Maxx, my work, bought the Manchester version. My hair is a pure mess because of the wind. We were in Primark, and Josh. When I went to pay, I went to use my contact list, Josh like flew in and put his like card on the machine, the wee creator. Thank you. Very nice of you. I told him not to. And he said he was going to pay for it and I was like, no you're not. And he was away paying for his stuff and then I didn't even know where he was. And then he was like behind me. I turned around to see him and then I went to get my phone out to use my contact list and he pure flew his phone, phone, phone onto the machine. 
but very grateful. I have the best girl play ever. So I'm currently in Fit Logger, is that where we are? Josh is currently trying on a tracksuit. A black one and then he's trying on a grey one as well. He literally knows he looks good, that's the thing. Look at him checking himself out. Oh, well, look, week sexy. That's what he's thinking right now. He's like, mm, yeah. You gonna get it? Yeah. Okay, so currently in H&M, I've got quite a lot. I'm not going to lie, I kind of went ham. This is only the first floor, which is a bit of an issue. The next is this wee, like, green, like, sage green cropped hoodie. I actually really like this. I think it's really cute. And then I also have it in blue as well. So, yeah, I really like this. But the pockets are, like, pure up here. Obviously, you never use the pockets, but I think I'd wear, like, unzipped with, like, a nice, nice wee white top underneath it. It'd be nice with this outfit, actually. But obviously, I'm wearing it zipped because I haven't got a top on right now. I've only got my brown. So, yeah. See, the blue's nice. I don't really want to, like, flashy because I haven't got it zipped up right now. The blue is nice, but I don't know what I'd wear it with. Like, obviously, there's, like, this outfit I've got on. But, like, obviously, I wouldn't really wear, like, blue with, like, blue denim. It doesn't look right. So, I think this one's a no. Which is quite sad because it is so pretty. So this is like a black sweater, but I'm not a fan because the sleeves look a wee bit weird. Like they're really balloony. I just don't feel like I look right in it. Do you know what I mean? So this is a no. So I've currently got the darker um, green on of the hoodie, but this is like a like more of like a baggier one around here. Otherwise that one's like a bit like thinner around your stomach. I don't really know how I feel about like what kind of colour. I don't want to get too green. I like the exact same hoodie. Do you know what I mean? I'm kind of leaning towards this one because like the way it fits a bit better. I think I'm gonna go for this one. Okay, next is this wee jumper. I actually think it's quite cute. So I do. But I just don't know if I said it. The last two are trousers. I'm going to try this on with the trousers. Um, as in with like this. Well, not this because they obviously won't go. But I'm going to wear like these because I've been looking for dungarees for ages. So I'm going to try these on. Fingers crossed they're nice. Okay, these trousers are a big fat giant no. They're like the tiniest bit too short anyway, but like just, uh, no, no, definitely not. Big fat feel. These are a small and please look at the size of them. Like, oh my word. And like, 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 what, what like, why? What's going on? So I've decided I'm gonna go for the sage instead of the emerald green because I realized that I'd actually have a cropped emerald green, like drawstring hoodie, like instead of like a zip, obviously, but it's like a drawstring one, so I don't really need another one. So I'm gonna get that and then I'm gonna get the wee white undershirt, just like the wee white button up shirt. Don't actually know if, I don't think I showed you it. No, I didn't. Or did I? I'm not too sure, but yeah, I'm gonna get them too. Today's lunch is the KFC. I asked for a mini chicken fillet just so it's on its own, and I was like, please, just don't, not as a burger, just on its own, and they gave me a burger anyway, so sure, here we are. We've been in JD's for, I'd say, about 30 seconds. Josh has left it about 10 things for me to try on. He bought that great tracksuit earlier on, and then he found me one that's the exact same. He wants us to go matchy, matchy, he says. And then he left it in black as well, and like, I just, I can't be coping with him, I swear. Okay, so it's a wee while later. We've been down to a few wee shops. Um, I went in this JD's, I think I was showing you, I'm not too sure. But I tried on that grey tricep and the black tricep that Josh literally grabbed for me. And Josh paid for half of the grey tricep. Even though he shouldn't have, but he wouldn't let me pay. So he paid for half of the grey tricep. Yeah, so he paid for half of it and now we have a matching grey tricep. And Josh was like, I want us to go matchy matchy and all. I was like, but, like Josh, we're not actually going to wear them out in public together. And he was like, yeah, we are with our air forces. Where is it? We'll just change when we go home and then we'll just. Why would I buy a pair of air forces? Oh, just so we could go home and see my outfit. No, I'm good, thanks. I have a pair of home. Uh, but yes, yeah, so we're just basically walking about with quite a lot of heavy bags. I had to buy, I bought like an elf concealer. It's like, I've actually heard loads of people who use it, but I want to try using it for contour. Now they all use all the ones I've watched, they use it for concealer. But I'm going to try and use it for contour because my contour stick is leaving, do you see? Big patches of no makeup on my face whenever I blend it out and it's really doing my head in. And it is a foundation stick so it's really hard to blend out. So obviously a concealer is a bit li more liquid so it'll be a bit easier. So yeah. We're at the bottom floor at the minute. Don't even know where we're going now. I'm just following Josh at this point. Where are we going? Uh, Selfridges. Am I going to Selfridges? Harvey Nichols. Where? Harvey Nichols as well. Harvey Nichols? What's that? Okay, I will see you soon. When I tell you today that Josh and I have shopped how we dropped, oh my goodness. And surprisingly enough, I haven't spent that much money. Like, I'm not even joking. Like, this whole trip, I haven't spent. Like, I thought I would have like, spent like the whole bank account I have right now, but. I literally haven't spent that much. Hi everyone. So, back in the hotel. I can't, I, have I vlogged since I've got home? 
don't actually know. Okay, well, if I haven't, I'm back in the hotel with Josh. We're bloody knackered. But I'm gonna give you a quick haul of today. This is the final um, haul that you're gonna be getting because we're not shopping tomorrow. We're we shopped out. So, went to the Arndale shopping centre today. Went to Trafford Centre yesterday. What one do you think was better? The Arndale for the... Yeah, I think so too. And we weren't expecting it. We weren't even like planning on going to it. And then we realised it's like five minutes away from our hotel. So we just were like, oh sure. And oh my God, the size of it. We nearly got lost about 10 times. We like circled the same thing like four times and we were like, have we not been here before? And they were like, oh my God, no, we haven't. It was like a whole new section of the shopping center. And we were like, goodness gracious, it's huge. So, quick wee haul. Now, first thing I needed, needed, there was two things I needed. It was something to do with cream contour and makeup wipes. And I done, I was successful. I got both in the same shop. I went into Superdog and I got them both. So, some makeup wipes. I ran out of makeup wipes this morning when I done this makeup because I took my makeup off and then done it all over again because of basically my cream contour. It's been really annoying. Like as you can see, like you see, like there's you can't really see, but there's like patches of like no makeup. Like look, and that's because like I'm using like a foundation stick and it's quite hard to like blend out. So it's probably taking off my foundation underneath. So it's not it's leaving me with patches of no makeup, which is really annoying me. So I was like, I'm gonna get a new. Um, cream contour but I'm gonna get a liquid one this time like a concealer but that's not the point I used my makeup wipes up so I had to get some more and this came in a multi-pack so this is good these are the best makeup wipes in the world these are the simple just cleansing cleansing facial wipes I don't know why I couldn't say that but these are the best makeup wipes in the world and they're so like they're really like soft on your face and stuff and your skin so just know that and then I got two things of cream contour because if you look at the colour difference these are only one shade apart one shade, like what the flip? So this was one shade and then this was the next shade up. Look at the, the darkness of one of them compared to the other. Like what? I did test them out, the testers on my hands because they actually have testers here. They don't have testers back in Valmina. I don't think they do. Anyway, they might have them back in now but I don't think they do because of COVID obviously. But yeah, so I tested them out my hand and I was like, goodness gracious, that one's wild dark and then that one was like quite light or something. So I was like, I could do a mixy bobby situation but I'm really scared. So I'm just gonna leave this makeup on tonight and then I'll try these out when I go home, like maybe tomorrow or something. No, when I go home, Sunday probably. Or Monday because I'm off because Sunday I'm going out for dinner for my birthday with my, with my family. So probably not going to test them out on Sunday in case I mess up my makeup again. So yes, I got them. They're just the e.l.f. concealers. So the darker ones in the shade Rich Chocolate and then the lighter shades in Deep Chestnut. So I got those. Then... We went into JD's. Now, I did tell you, I think, that Josh decided to pay for half a tracksuit for me. He turned around to me and was like, I'm paying half of it and all. And I was like, no, you're not. So I just went, oh, sure, I'll just buy it. So I bought it myself and then he transferred me half of it. We creator that he is. So this is it here. Now, normally I prefer the bottoms of a, of a tracksuit, like joggers, to be like cuffed. Is that what they're called? Ribbed? Ribbed? Cuffed? I don't know. But um, these are cuffed as well, but they're not like the cuffs that are normally on joggers. They're like this type of cuff on them. And oh my word, they fit. Unbelievable. So I got these in an extra small. And then I also got the hoodie in an extra small. They also, which I didn't figure out till after it, were to have a sweater of it. And the sweater is actually really nice as well. But I think I like the hoodie because Josh got the hoodie as well. So he wanted me to get the hoodie. But yeah, so this is the matching hoodie for it. Unreal. So the hoodie was 55 and the bottoms were 35 So £90. Disgusting. Then we went into H&M and obviously I did vlog in H&M so I got the Sage hoodie. I was going to get the emerald green one but then I realised I have a cropped emerald green hoodie but it just doesn't have a zip. It's got like a drawstring. But yeah so I got that. It's really nice. I think it would be nice like opened up with like joggers and like a nice really, like, white crop top or something underneath it. And then, oh I thought that was the bed sheet. <laughs> and then I got the button up cropped shirt type thing. So yeah I got that hoodie in a small and then I got this in a small as well because I did try on the extra small but I kind of wanted it to be a bit like baggier do you know what I mean and then finally Primark so I got this bag now I have fallen in love with tote bags and that is all thanks to my cousin Clara so she's got me in love with them and I've always wanted one with an N on it I love stuff with my name or N's on it more more an N than my name so I've literally wanted one of these for pure ages with like the letter N on it because obviously it's the start of my name Duh. but yeah so I got that I don't even know how much that was two pound for that wee tote bag which is quite cute then I got this skirt. This skirt is actually pure stunning on. I actually lifted it. It said a four on the hanger. It was really a small. So they went an extra small or small. It wasn't like four, six, eight. 
and um, so I went back and there was an extra small which is good this was eight pound so it's like really nice it's like a sheer material it's not like a normal like thick skirt and then where is it it's got a big slit it's not a big slit but it's got a slit up the side as well so i really do like that i pure love midi skirts oh they're so nice or mid axis skirts whatever you want to call them oh by the way that wee skirt was eight pound then i got a swimming costume now my mother's going to kill me i'm not going to lie so i got this like swimming costume i think this would be so nice with my hair being the length it is and the color it is so yeah it's just like this and um, like low cut like v this is the, obviously the same style of ones i wore when we were in tenerife and then it ties round this I got in a size 6 and it was £12, so I'm excited about that. I haven't actually tried it on yet, but I found out that you can return in Northern Ireland, thankfully. So if any of this doesn't, if I end up changing my mind, I can return it. So I also got another bikini. Now these were only £2, well £2 for the top, £2 from the bottoms. I did see the top in Ballymena, like the Ballymena Primark, um, just before we left to go to here just to come to manchester but they had no bottoms so i was like i'm not getting up here bikini if it's got no bottoms of course they had the bottoms and the top in primark here so the top the bottoms were two pound and the top was two pound as well i got the bottoms in a six and the top in a 14 just because obviously i've got a wee bit of a bigger chest then the last wee things are a couple of little wee lingerie sets oh my word these are pure stunning so they're like silk lingerie sets and yes i know it looks pure tiny but it's actually not um, I always wear extra small in these wee sets. So these were £7 each. So I got them all in an extra small. Again, extra small in these ones. And then the like wee ribbed lingerie sets that everyone seems to be having from Primark. So I got it in black. I got it in like a creamy like champagne-y colour. Which I think this is my fave. And then I got it in a nice wee red colour. How beautiful is that? <sighs> so yeah, that's my haul. Um, it's currently half five. We said we were going to go for dinner at six. So you still want to go for dinner at six? Yeah. Yeah, right, six here. Between six and half six. Between six and half six, we say we're going to Pizza Hut tonight because Josh wants to go to Pizza Hut. But I'm going to just chill out. I need to get changed and stuff. I think I'm just going to go like quite casual tonight. I haven't really got like a really dress outfit like last night's outfit. I've just got like my leather leggings with me and then like a wee. I have a white top and then like a knitted vest for the top of it. Or else I might wear a wee HDM top I have that I got just before I came to Manchester. It's like a silk one. It's, it's actually pure stunning. But. Yeah, I'm not too sure yet. And then just probably my Converse's because I don't really want to wear heels. I was going to wear them green heels and then I was like, mm, don't really know if I can be bothered. So, yes, that is really all for now. I'll probably hit you up whenever we are about to leave or when I'm ready and whatnot. We're both pure wrecked, I'm not going to lie. That was a shopping day and a half. If I've ever seen one, that was a shopping day and a half, let me tell you. Okay, so hi guys. Uh, we're now ready. Um, Josh actually didn't change his outfit whatsoever. <laughs> But um, yeah, um, I changed my outfit also. These flyaway hairs, I can't be coping. Look, when can I show you? Like the amount of wee hairs that stick out in the top of my head as well. Like it's actually not even funny. Oh my, like, but yes, topped up the makeup a wee bit. Just like put some like more like bronzer and stuff on. Didn't really do much to be honest with you. And then the fit. So yes, this is the fit. Excuse the pure empty bags. That's just the bags we had from today and yesterday. So I'm wearing my white Converse's, my new look leather leggings, um, my white top is from Stradivarius, and this wee knitted jumper vest, sorry, is from Shein, a girl I know, Taylor. She actually um, had this and I tasted it and I was like, oh my word, where's it from? Because it's beautiful. And it was from Shein. So yeah, that's the fit for tonight. And here's just straight and makeup, just the makeup from today. So we're in Pizza Hut. <laughs> Um, we're in the competitors and look how good this looks. We were going to get a garlic bread to start but um, they didn't have any left which is quite upsetting but my pizza definitely looks better even Josh admitted it. Mmm yummy. And we go both for a Kohlberg and they give you like frozen glasses. They're not really frozen anymore but like they pure came and they were frozen and we just got some chippies. Unreal. So we're now in a very loud pub. Josh got a sex on the beach and I got a smirn off ice. We're currently watching the Man United match. It's the only seats we could get. I'm being watched. But yeah, Man United are winning 1 0. Josh and I neither support Man United. But here we are, we're watching the game. <laughs> Say like quarter to twelve maybe. I don't know, I haven't got my phone in the bathroom with me. 
But I'm going to end this vlog here because I'm going to bed and I'm absolutely shattered. Like, I'm not enjoying, I'm so tired. And um, think that day is shopping. Like, seriously, I got in there. Like, I'm not joking. I did. Dinner was delicious. We literally just sat in that bar and watched the game. And they had, like, unreal music on afterwards. Like, it was so good. But, yeah. I'm going to end the vlog here for today. I don't know if I'm actually going to vlog tomorrow because... I don't really think we're doing much. Like mostly it's just going home and I don't really we haven't actually got any plans. We said we wanted a bit of a lie in because like we haven't actually got like to go up and go shopping because we haven't got any more shops going to. That's really it I think for today. But I will let we will see tomorrow I suppose if I'm gonna vlog. But for now anyway, that's everything for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I love you all. Have a great tonight for watching this. I love you. Peace out. I'm going to bed. Good night. I'm shard.